We have a vowel team that we're going to talk about. It's a fun one. Right above my head. Do you see those two O's? Mm-hmm. You might think it looks like two eyeballs looking at you. And those two O's are going to say, ooh, in all of the words that we look at today. For example, moon. Let's go ahead and roller coaster that word. M ooh n. Moon with the ooh right in the middle. How about where you go swimming? Pool. Go for it. P ooh -wool. Pool had that ooh right in the middle with those two O's. Do you see an animal? Mm-hmm. A moose. Go for it. M ooh Moose has that ooh in the middle. And you might use one of these when you eat your soup or your ice cream. Grab your spoon. Let's stretch this one. Ready? Spoon. Spoon has that ooh in the middle. Let's now read some of these words. Look for those two O's and get your ooh ready. P ooh -o. Pool. The animal. Ooh. Moose. Hey, when there's that E at the end of an O O word, just don't even worry about it. Who knows why it's there? Ready? How about what you eat with? Spoon. Spoon. Now, let's get, look at some words that we didn't have a picture of. Here they come. Cool. Yeah, you're so cool. A flower does this. What'd you say? Bloom. Another animal coming your way. Goose. Yeah, it has that E like moose. Don't even worry about that E. Just get the O in the middle. And this is a time of day. Noon. You might have a wiggly one of these. Yes, tooth. Man, you did a great job reading all those ooh words. I think that oh, oh might be an easier sound for you to remember. What do you think? You did great.